So last week I played the brand new Solar Smash update, and then you guys told me in the comments I pretty much did everything wrong. So today we're actually gonna play the brand new update. What is going on, TFG Squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome back to Solar Smash. I am jumping right into Planet Smash. The first thing you guys told me to do was throw the moon at Mercury. Yep, that's how we're gonna start off this video. So if I go to Mercury, I think it's one of the new planets right here. So basically from what you guys told me, Mercury and the moon are about the same size. So if I throw the moon at Mercury, it should be the same size as the planet. I'm not sure how accurate this game is. Oh my gosh, it actually is. Okay, uh, okay, Mercury is a little bit bigger than the moon, but not that much. It actually kind of looks like the Death Star right now. Well, that wasn't fun enough, so we're gonna throw, like, ten moons at Mercury just to see what happens. I might have clicked more than ten times. There might be, like, hundreds. Oh, jeez. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We've got eight. Oh, man, and there is debris flying all over the place. If you guys want to see more Solar Smash on the channel, don't forget to hit that like button and make sure you subscribe right now. Okay, there is a shard of one of the moons flying off into the cosmos. Okay, well, nobody lived on Mercury before, but, uh, nobody will ever live on Mercury now. So enough blowing up other planets. Time to get right to business and blow up planet Earth because that's what we do best. You guys told me to fire the Gauss cannon at planet Earth, but have the game be paused and then something really cool happens. Let's go to the Gauss cannon, which is the brand new weapon in the update. It's actually pretty amazing. You guys are about to see it now. I'm going to aim right for India. I know a lot of you guys are from India and you always want me to blow up your country. Here we go. I'm blowing up India. I'm, I'm actually really sorry about this. I'm only doing this because you guys told me to do it. Three, two, one, go. Oh, that is so awesome. Whoa. So the Gauss cannon is so powerful and it is so fast that it can blow up a planet even while the game is paused. That's how fast it is. It's faster than the speed of light. At least that's my guess. Look at the little, like, there's like little loop-de-loops. That's the, oh, I love the Gauss cannon. I literally put a hole through the entire planet. So I destroyed, I, I mean, India no longer exists. And then who did I blow up on the other side of the world? Oh, I think I just missed South America. Chile, you got very lucky there, my friends. I think I just blew up part of the ocean. Okay, this was actually kind of cool. Well, let's fly through the large hole with the dragon. Let me show you what the dragon dragon does first, and then I'm gonna do the cool thing. So the, the, the brand new monster in the Solar Smash update is this dragon. I named- I don't remember what I named him. Oh, I think I named him Newt. Yeah, I named him Newt. N-E-W-T. So if I fire Newt at planet Earth, he's actually fairly awesome. He shoots like a- like a purple fire at planet Earth, and he- he goes through the entire planet. But what you guys told me to do, if I- what was that sound? I think Newt just, like, flew past me and, like, gargled. Maybe he's hungry? I oh, you can see Newt all the way down there! He's flying over to the sun to ruin the sun's day. So you guys told me if I go to target mode, I can actually fly the dragon in this game, which sounds absolutely incredible and amazing. So I'm going to try to fly the dragon through planet Earth and see if I can make it. It's a little narrow, so we might have to make the hole through planet Earth a little bit bigger and, you know, kill billions of more people, which always makes me feel bad, but not bad enough not to do it. Okay, so let's go to tar- I already have the dragon selected. I have Newt selected. Let's go to target target mode, and we're gonna aim, uh, well, it doesn't really matter where we aim, because we are going to be flying, three, two, one, go! Oh my gosh, I'm flying a dragon in Solar Smash. Oh my gosh, I'm flying a dragon in Solar Smash, so if I press the button, I'm breathing fire! Oh, this is the greatest day of my life! I always say it's the greatest day of my life when I do something in games that's fun, but this is- Look at this! I am flying through planet Earth while breathing fire- in a dragon. This is incredible. Look at the graphics in this game. Oh my gosh. I'm in love with this game. You guys already know how much I love Solar Smash. Oh, I got another idea. So if I go out of target mode. Uh oh, oh. I think I blew up Newt. Either that or he just farted and then uh, traveled at, at light speed away. I, I think I just killed Newt. Well, good for Newt that uh, Newt had a baby brother also named Newt. I'm going to call him Newt Jr. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm going to go super speed. So I'm going to be flying a dragon through planet Earth at supersonic speed. All right, here we go. So I'm going to go to target mode. I'm already in super speed and fire. 
But, excuse me, Newt. Newt Jr., will you wake up from your, your three-year nap? I don't know. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. I am flying. Oh, it's going to be really hard. Oh, jeez. Okay, I can't hit the edges. I can't hit the edges. Oh, my gosh. So, if I breathe fire in the direction of the sun, it's probably not going to It's probably not gonna reach. No, it's definitely not. Wait, so what happens if I fly Newt into planet Earth? Oh, my gosh. Look how far away I got. Does Newt blow up? Like, what happens to Newt? I'm gonna be breathing fire, and hopefully he'll just go through the planet. I'm sorry if you blow up, Newt Jr. Oh my. I literally breathed fire so strong that I made it all the way through planet Earth. I'm sorry that I'm screaming, but I am so excited right now. Thank you guys so much for telling me this stuff in the comment section. Newt is so strong that he can fly all the way... I think I just blew up Newt. Yep, I, I literally just blew up Newt. You can see the crater right there from when he he stuck his nose through Africa. Well, Newt Jr. was really fun as it lasted. Wait, can I go to target mode as the snake? Like, can I go to target mode? Oh, I thought I was I thought I was flying the snake there for a second. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get out of here. The next thing you guys told me to do was go to Jelly World, also called Ghost World. And now they're going to give me an advertisement. I paid for ad free. I paid $3.99 so I didn't have to watch any ads. I'm not going to go super speed. I just want to go regular speed, but I'm going to go back to Newt. This is uh, Newt the third. It's Newt's uh, grandson, also named Newt. Okay, now we're going to go back to target mode. I'm going to fly Newt into the side of Jelly World and also breathe fire while I'm doing it. Let's see. Can we make it through Jelly World? Oh, it looks like we can. Newt is so awesome. Literally breathing fire through entire planets. I mean, it, this is awesome. I know I keep saying it's the greatest day of my life, but it's literally the greatest day of my life. Look at this. I can, I can go in any... <sighs> Every time I get overconfident... Wait, wait, let me go out of target mode. What did I... Whoa, look at that. You can see like the little path that I went through. Wait, well, I can't finish now. Let's go to target mode. Let's go fire. Oh, geez, this is a little fast. Newt, I hope you... Aim correctly. Okay. Okay, there we go. I actually made it through the jelly world this time. I want to see what it looks like from the outside when I fire a dragon that's breathing supersonic fire at a jelly planet. That's what I want to see right now. Okay. <gasps> what the heck was that, man? You are no newt. You're Jim. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Beast. I mean nothing against you. I just mean Jim the... the fire breathing dragon he literally barely put a dent in jelly world okay here we go <gasps> what the heck is that they literally give jelly world a, a, a gentle haircut at that point a, a pat on the back maybe a little neck massage i mean what the heck is this look what i did i burrowed my way all the way through jelly world and came out the other side it's like when you eat a spicy taco and then you fart it out the next morning and newt jr just uh, i mean he's giving it a kiss on the cheek he, he's literally giving giving Jelly World a kiss on the cheek. Okay, well, it's your fault now, Newt the Fifth, or whatever you are. But now I gotta blow up this planet because I am so angry. We gotta go to the giant planetary destroying laser man. We gotta make him a five out of five. We gotta make him frustrated gamer purple. We gotta make it supersonic speed, and we gotta go fire. Here we go. Three, two, one, and there we go. Frozen jelly shards for everybody in the atmosphere. The next thing I did wrong in the update was with the grid. So I just thought they were kind of cool and I could kind of aim. But you guys were like, Brandon, you can use the grids to turn planet Earth into whatever shape you want. So first things first, we're going to try to unlock Cube World. And then I'm going to try to turn planet Earth into one of the great pyramids. First things first, we're going with the cube. Nice and simple. So we're going to go uh, X... Y and Z, but that's bigger than planet Earth, so I need to start shrinking this down a little bit. Now, this seems like it's going to be a absolutely wonderful cube, and hopefully I'll unlock the secret planet. So let's go over to the laser. What's a color I've never done? I don't think I've ever done orange. We're going to go with orange right now. And, uh, yeah, let's, let's turn planet Earth into a cube. Is this, is this going to work? I hope so. You guys told me this should work. Oh, yeah, look at that. So it's like a perfect cut. And the rest of the people on planet Earth are actually still alive somehow. That's that's some sort of a miracle. All right, let's keep going. We're going to turn planet Earth into a perfect cube. I mean, it's not bad. It looks more like, uh, you know, dice that you roll because of the, like, rounded edges. I think I needed to make the cube a little bit smaller. But let's reset the planet and maybe we will unlock the secret cube world. And I didn't unlock the secret cube world. 
Okay, let's make the grid a little bit smaller. Three days later. Look at this. This is a perfect magma cube with literally nobody living on there. Time to reset the planet again and hopefully unlock the new world. I literally got another ad. I got it. Achievement unlocked. Chopped the earth into a cube and I unlocked the brand new cube world, which we kind of already saw in a previous video. But you know what we're going to do really quickly. We're going to go to the uh, Newt, the 87th. Yep, it's, it's Newt's 87th grandson. And we're going to put a hole through the entire cube world. Oh, 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 this is getting violent. Okay, I... Ow! I think I, I think I left the grid there. Yeah, I left the, oops, I left, I left the grid there. That's why Newt kept spontaneously exploding. Sorry about that, Newt. Let's try that again. Yeah, you might be scared right now, but, but you're, you should be okay. There's no force field in your way now. Okay, there we go. This is awesome. Okay, time to turn planet Earth into a, a great pyramid. Okay, I am realizing very quickly how ridiculously long this is gonna take. So let's do one of those cool time lapses where, uh, you know, it takes me an hour to do it, but you guys can experience it in like 10 seconds. Okay, uh, this pyramid is what the Egyptians used to call uh, uh, not good, but you know what? It's actually not terrible, better than the way I thought it was going to come out. Let me know what I should do next in Solar Smash. Don't forget to hit that subscriber button and check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. Go to that channel and subscribe right now, and I will see all of you in the next video.